Hello everyone, this is going to be my review of the new Less Than Jake album, See the Lights. And I picked this album up on the Fat Wreck Tour when they came to Cleveland, Ohio about a week ago now. And um, I went to this show mainly to see one of my favorite current bands today, Mast Intruder. And I was very pleasantly surprised by Less Than Jake. I was never really a huge Less Than Jake fan. The only other album I have by them is Borders and Boundaries, which I didn't really listen to a lot. But after seeing them live and picking this album up, um, I've gone back to that one, and I'm, I want more or Less Than Jake now. But anyways, let's get to this album. Um, this is definitely going to be on one of my, uh, you know, one of the, it's going to be one of the albums on my year-end list of 2013. Um, very pleasantly surprised by this. Uh, I feel, I, the thing I like about Less Than Jake is they don't feel like they're a 90s ska band. They feel like, they feel like, I don't know, I don't know how to explain it, but they just feel relevant. To today like I know there's some bands out there that you know they just feel like they're stuck in the 90s and they can't get out of it but I feel less than Jake is I feel like a nostalgic time capsule sort of like how the Ramones captured the Beach Boys essence in the 70s and 80s I feel like less than Jake captures sort of the 90s ska revival you know baggy shorts chain wallet thing I feel like they bring that into the now but they don't it, it doesn't come off as being trite cheesy or anything um, anyways onto this let's get to the material on this album now you know it's I can't really compare it to anything else but it's fun because you know I have not really heard much less than Jake but anyways it's fun it's it's got just enough horns to, as to where it's, you know, you're not being beaten over the head with sort of like the brass instruments. Like I said, I'm not really hu I'm not really huge into ska if I said that, but if I didn't, I'm not huge into ska. Um, but less than Jake might change my opinion on that because these guys, I don't know, they just there's just something about this the, them that Maybe it's, maybe it's because they're more of like they sound more like pop punk with horns. I mean, no offense to less than Jake fans. I've not really heard much of their material outside of this Borders and Boundaries and uh, you know the few scattered singles from the '90s. Um, you know, the songs I like on this album are good enough. My money is on the long shot and. I really like the song Bless the Cracks, track six. Um, I feel like this album is a definite must have. Uh, Best Buy has it, I think, uh, but I'd recommend ordering it off of Fat Records Direct, Fat Records directly. Um, what else can I say about it? Uh, if you want something cool, fun, and unique for today, today's music definitely pick up the new less than Jake album see the lights uh, you won't be disappointed unless you're just like bitter and your favorite artist is Danzig I guess that's like the only way that I would think you'd be disappointed in less than Jake I mean if you're a punk fan pop punk fan uh, ska fan this is this is a must-have. It shows that there's still life in what you know a lot of artists deem as you know out of style. I don't know. I think if ska came back like this, like you know, a less than Jake album, I feel like it would. I would be a huge fan of it. Um, sounds like I'm rambling now. I better just cut this short. Um, I'm going to give this a 4 out of 5, mainly because I've heard that there are better less than Jake albums than 
borders and boundaries and I'm sure that you know I'm gonna check out Hello Rockview and Losing Streak next probably uh, but this album here is gonna hold a place in my heart you know because it probably it got me into them really it, it you know borders and boundaries started it but this one really just sort of solidified it maybe the show I went to too that may have solidified it but anyways four out of five uh, definitely if you find this get it if you're a fan of punk ska anything like that um, bye